Hello people, welcome back to another unboxing on this channel. This time it is the very special Geek Gear Wizardry Limited Edition Potion Master box. I have been super excited about this one, even more so than the others because it's a Potion Master. I'm expecting at least one, maybe two potions maybe to add to my potion section. Oh, I've been dreaming about it, what's going to be in here, and yeah, I'm very excited to open this for you guys. Let's have a little look at the box, first of all, as we always do with these limited editions. So, they have different potion bottles going around the outside on this box, which again, just heightens the enthusiasm for me that there are going to be potions in here. I'm very excited. If you guys are too, then keep on watching, leave a like if you enjoy this video, and if you're new to my channel, then don't forget to subscribe to join my little magical corner. Da, da, da. There you go, a little hint. So we're gonna pick out a wearable first and it does look very potion-y. Here is the t-shirt in this box. So it's white, it says Potions Master and there's different potions on the t-shirt. So we have Comfort, Transform, Love, Deep Sleep and Confusion. Okay, so what do I think about this t-shirt? Well. Let's just get rid of the M sticker because nobody needs that. I don't know if it may have been better on a different colored t-shirt. Maybe not black, not necessarily black, but like a dark purple or something, a green maybe, I don't know. And if all the potion bottles, all the liquids may be in different colors, further represent different potions. But apart from that, it's really nice actually. These t-shirts are always really nice quality. And it is definitely something I would wear because I'm a potions master. Look at all these potions I have created. Um, but yeah, I like that. It's a nice start so far. We have a licensed product in here, guys. It is a travel mug. I actually really like these travel mugs. I am collecting them now. I'm getting quite a few of these now. So yeah, building up a collection. So it's very orange. The lid is a very bright orange. I actually quite like that. It's very snazzy and it stands out. So yes, it's patterned in all things potions. There is a cauldron which looks like the cover of the advanced potion making book. There's different potion labels all around the outside. I really like this, I really do. I, I, I love these travel mugs. I actually prefer getting travel mugs in these boxes than normal mugs. It's really nice quality, really heavy. Yeah, I genuinely really like this. Yes, it's another win. Okay, so this definitely makes a change from beanie hats that they have put in these boxes before. It's a hat. It's one of those caps. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. <laughs> what do you guys think? Does it suit me? It says Potions Master on it, as you can see. I really like that, actually. I don't know if I have the guts to wear it out and about, but I do really like that. I love the green color on it. It's really nice quality. Oh, I really like it actually. As I said, I don't usually wear these kind of hats. I don't really wear hats anyway, but yeah, it's, it's different. It's exciting. Oh my God, we have two pins. We have two pins. That is so cute. So these are from Forever Pins. This is the first one. So it is a love potion pin. That is so nice. It's like, I'm trying to learn the difference between soft enamel and hard enamel. I think this is soft enamel. Oh, that's so cute. I love the colors. I love the style of it, everything about it. And yeah, I am a massive pin collector right now. So these are going straight on my pin board. Oh yes. I love that so much, that's so cool. And the second one, okay, this is really cute. So it says Potions Master, it is green. The lettering is like silver. We have had a Potions Master pin in one of these boxes before, but it was huge. This one just looks so much fancier, so much nicer. And yeah, I love it. This is definitely something you could wear out and about just to have a little bit of, wow, Harry Potter pride but also show off your potion skills you are a master at potions yes I, I really like that I love both of these pins very excited I've had my eye on two boxes two white boxes in this subscription box which I've, I've been looking at but I've been like okay I, I have a feeling that they might be potions so okay I'm just I'm just gonna get them out now they are very heavy for the size of the boxes. Yeah, they're not giving anything away. No hints. Okay, so which one should I go for first? I'm gonna go for the bigger one. Oh, please be a potion. It's looking good. Oh my God, yes. Yes, look at this. It's a potion and it's really nice quality. Again, it has like the glittery stuff in it, but 
I forgive that. I actually like that about these Geek Gear potions. There, there is twine. Cherry Wallace will be happy with the twine. I know she likes her twines. Cork top. So this is the Draught of Living Death. It also says, causes the drinker to sleep, which can last indefinitely. Extremely powerful, sends drinker into a death-like slumber. Extremely dangerous potion, executes with maximum caution. There you go, there's a little warning label on there for you. The label itself uh, is a bit wonky, but I'm sure I can fix that. But yes, I love this, love it. It's, it's, it's definitely going with that lot, definitely. The next box. It's another potion. Oh my God, yes. Yes, oh, there's even a little charm thing on it. So here it is. This is Wolfsbane Potion. There's some more writing right at the bottom, which I can't really see. Wolfsbane Potion, it's a different size and shape bottle, which I love, more twine. There's a little charm of a werewolf on it. That's such a nice touch. Ah, oh, I am so in love with these potions. I know that these are gonna be my favorite things in the box. These, This is what I've been looking forward to most. This this is a really, really good box. I, I am so happy right now. We have another one of these, which only tells me it's gonna be another beautiful painting of something, well, potion related. There seems to be something on the back. Oh, wow, wow. I am in love with this. Look at this, oh my gosh, yes. So it's a little potion shelf display. There is, oh my God, that's Snape's wand. So this is Snape's office. There's a book, there are loads of potions. There's a potion brewing. So we have aromatic quick slumber, wormwood. Don't talk to me about wormwood. The amount of times I was after Wormwood when I was playing Wizards Unite. <laughs> Elixir of Growth, Draught of Sharp Sight, Blood Worm, Purified Slug Juice, ooh, that sounds nice. <laughs> Venom of Dittany, Mermaid Tears, oh, that is so cool. And at the top there, there's a skull and some more books. Niffler Sweat, I've just, I've just noticed Niffler Sweat. <laughs> what can you use with Niffler Sweat? Oh, I think this is my favourite print we've had, like, in a very very long time it's up there with the forks one and the dobby one we've had recently oh the, these prints they're making me want to buy more a3 frames and put them on my wall somewhere i'm running out of space but they're going up somewhere oh, i'm so in love with that yeah i was talking about something on the back so on the back it has the same image but it's in black and white and it says advanced potion making illustration by paul tonner so this is by paul tonner not by Kevin, can't remember who the other one was who did the Dobby one and the Forks one, so okay. It has his website on there. I've actually been on his website. Exclusive for Geek Gear, geekgearbox.co.uk. Yeah, oh, I'm so, so in love with that. Oh, I, I can look at that all day. That is so cool. This box, man, this box is doing wonderful things. I've just seen the print, and if it is what I think it is, this is wonderful. This is so good. Oh my God, I'm actually crying. And I've got watery eyes anyway, because <laughs> I got makeup in my eyes. So if it's coming off, that's why. By order of the Department for the Regulation and Control of Potions, achievement in alchemical and magical excellence, Potions Master, you put your name down. The Ancient and Esoteric Department for the Regulation and Control of Potions hereby certify that Having studied and met the required standards of excellence in this field as set out by the DRCP guidelines, the person named above is deemed proficient in the procurement of ingredients and elements, space or otherwise, and by transmutation, transmogrification, or metamorphosis of such, into potions with the biggest level of magical competence. It's signed by Eugenia Buttersworth, who is head of the Department for the Regulation and Control of Potions, and Magnus Quirk, who is the Grand Potions Master Transmuter First Class. In witness thereof, we confirm the above and sign our names as evidence of the fact. Just look at this, it's proper, beautiful quality card. It's so, so, so pretty, so professional looking. Oh my gosh, I'm so in love with this. I, I didn't think 
anything could possibly trump the potions or even the Paul Tonner print, but I don't know, this, this is pretty cool, this is pretty special. I'm gonna frame it, it's going on my little shelves I have over here next to my OWL results. <laughs> okay, so this box has exceeded my expectations to be honest because although I loved some of the items in like the Dobby box and the Hogwarts Express box, I didn't have such high expectations. I mean, I hoped there would be potions in here, but I didn't know what else they would possibly do to make this box so special. I mean, I knew there'd be a print in it, didn't know if it was gonna be any good. Um, but yeah, I'd say apart from maybe the t-shirt, I am absolutely in love with everything else in this box. I am on cloud nine right now, I'm so happy. And it's there are things in this box that I am going to cherish for a very, very long time. And the fact that I can say that, you know how special this box is and how, how happy I am with it. So yes, I don't know what else I can say. Uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comments. What was your favorite item? I, it's impossible for me to say. I mean, the certificate, the potions print, the Paul Tonner print, the potions themselves, even the pins are really awesome. I, I don't have a favorite. I, can't, I cannot possibly pick a favorite in this box, but let me know if you can. I'm happy. I'm a happy little bunny. So there are nine items in this box, which is really good for any of these boxes. We had the exclusive potions t-shirt, the potions master cap, the potions master certificate, which I love, love so much. The potion master poster, also freaking amazing. Potion master pin, love potion pin by Forever Magic, draught of living death potion, potions travel mug and the wolfsbane potion and at the bottom there it just says potions master with some more potions on the bottom the best limited edition box we've had thus far i know the next one is going to be house pride or house related which i am going to be buying hopefully there you go that's the end of the video please leave a like if you enjoyed the video that would mean a lot to me if you're new to my channel and you haven't already then why not subscribe to join my little magical corner thank you all very much for watching and i will see you next time